Hello internet people, welcome to my YouTube channel. So, today, you might notice we're in a different area, because I needed space, because I need to open up this big boy, big girl. And this is the Blythe 20 Years of Love doll, anniversary doll from so kindly gifted to me through the ball jointed doll scholarship from Allison of Munissa's Poopies and Dolls. I think I said that right. Anyway, so this is the ball jointed doll thing and thank you Allison from one Allison to another. So we're gonna open this today and Probably redress her because that's what I do and that have introduced her to her Blythe family. <laughs> so let's get open with the sharp object. This one came from CC Toys who is a good place to purchase lights that you might not be able to get, you know, on June. It's cardboard. Yeah. And it came pretty quickly. Like, I was surprised. Really, really surprised. But, uh, voila. Box, box, box. Original box. Really cool. Uh, okay. My cat. He was doing something naughty over there. He's just playing with the pencil. Uh, no, don't do that. Don't leave pencils around my cat because he'll chew them. So, again, I had asked for her because, as you can see, she is quite a bit darker than these pale ladies over here. And so far, uh, Blake has already come in pale and kind of tanned. So having a very dark skin tone is a very big step for them and um, I really wanted to add her to my collection. And so this box has shiny, ooh, lacy, lacy and gold, gold, gold. Looking at the instructions back there. I wonder what that stick I have to say with the stickers. But again. Probably doesn't look that great because I can't even see the camera. Let's get her. Ooh, it's an envelope. Yes. I know. It's exciting. I'm excited. I don't think. Oh my gosh. Ah! Oh yes, this was the 
the COA little card thing. Allison actually wrote, read this on her thing, so she also did an unboxing video. And that's a cat feeder. There is so much tape on this. Hmm. Well, you can watch me struggle and I'll fast forward through it. You know, it's been a while when you're like, what? I don't remember there being so much stuff on the last doll I got, which was this one, which is Sailor C. And she's free. Does she have? Mail truck's here. And you can hear my whiny boy. Yeah, I know. No, you can't go in the basement. But, oh, here comes trouble. Excuse me. But here she is. And this lighting is not as great as I thought it was going to be. Ah, it, what are you chewing on? Gorgeous. Those eyes are actually blue. No, like blue green. Excuse me. Those are not blue, sir. <laughs> anyway, so she has very beautiful hair. Just need to brush it out a bit. And I think her hair colors. Oh, you're dusty. I need to dust you. Pretty similar to C Sailor C, like C Sailor C. I guess that's a mouthful. Has like brown, dark brown, and light brown. And this cat. I don't know what you're doing, sir. But leave it alone. Not too bad. Like, this feels like waxy. Like these guys have very waxy feeling hair. I think it's just the type of hair they have. And her hair's not terrible. Actually, it feels drier, but oh, she has like a little thing. I guess it's her outfit. I think she, it's like a second outfit. So let's get her fully dressed. We'll put her earrings in. Earrings. I keep the earrings in. So she has pierced ears. My other girls don't. I think there was actually a we were just talking, Allison was just talking, the other Allison was just talking about that, whether or not, you know, if 
the girls if they're legit or not and if they have pierced ears and I guess it depends on the doll really because she has pierced ears these two don't so her nails are done let's see if I can't take her out of this Grecian thing. Very pretty. Oh, I'll probably redress someone in that. Because right now a lot of my people... Ooh! Sorry. A lot of my people are in like very casual things. Very casual outfits. But I need to go and put everyone in like super fancy outfits. And... That is a very neat way of doing that. They have just like a little fishing line right there for like an invisible look. It's Velcroed. Very thick Velcro. And a little petticoat. Super cute, actually. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I'll have to see because I have a dress picked out. I picked out two different things. I made a sweater for her and I picked out like a pants and a shirt and then I picked out a dress that I had made. So, I mean, this dress would be like really make it give it like that cute little poof. So, we'll, we'll try the pants on first because I'm a pants person and she has cute little lacy panties. All right, so this is the sweater that I knit up for her. This little cardigan. And we'll see, actually, because hmm. I have these jeans, but these are Barbie jeans. And just measuring them against her. Um, Sometimes I ask myself, I'm like, do I feel like rolling jeans? And I don't today. So we're going to put back on this petticoat. And then this is the dress that I made. It was from a a kit from Junie Moon and I probably should have put the petticoat on before after I put this on but you know live and learn things you need to know when you are putting on doll clothes if you have something like a slip put it on after you put on the main garment oh that's so cute on her Cute, cute. Dang it. Petticoat's a little too long. So that's going to go. Anyway. I'm going to put on this tiny sweater on you. Welcome to the family. You get a sweater. That's how I wear all. <laughs> you look so cozy. And I got, uh, these aren't vintage skipper screws. These are actually reproduction shippers, shippers, skipper shoes. They're like nice little white flats. Oop. 
and here she is super cute and in comparison if you want okay girls so <laughs> so you can see here next to her very dark complexion beautiful I like these lip colors because um, yeah, this is a very nice mauve color. And yes, so let's put you on your stand. There we go. So, uh, thank you so much, Allison, for choosing me for this scholarship and I absolutely adore her and I can't wait to dress her up more and yes thank you so much and I hope you enjoyed watching that and I'll see you guys in my next video and go check out uh, Allison's channel I'll leave a link in the description below so go check out her channel she has so much doll stuff it's really awesome so thanks again and I'll see you guys.